Hi everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to deactivate Snapchat account temporarily, right? So this way, if you have, if you want to deactivate your account, it will not delete any kind of your data and you can take a break from Snapchat, right? Now let's go into our Snapchat here. And once you're here, um, let me just click on agree. You have to tap on your profile icon, which is on the top left side corner. Once you do, on the top right, you will see the settings gear. Now scroll to the bottom and here you will get an option to delete your account, right? So somewhere you have to just find it. Let me show you. So guys, if you are not able to find the delete option here in the end of the, you know, interface, then you have to just go to help and basically you have to click on I need help, right? And they will redirect to your page and basically let it just load for now. And here you have to just click on delete my account, right? By the way, don't worry, your account is not getting uh, deleted. You can see to deactivate your delete your Snapchat account, follow this step below. This will deactivate your account for 30 days, right? So once you click on delete your account, your account will not, delete, uh, not get deleted instantly. It will get deactivated for 30 days. And if you don't come back, then your account will be get deleted, right? So to delete it, you can just basically follow this instruction here. And guys, from here, you have to just click on Snapchat account portal and it will redirect to your new page. And here you have to just enter your email address or username. And once you enter it, then you have to enter your password and your account will get, you know, deactivated for 30 days, right? So this is a only way, but in the latest feature of Snapchat, it's become very easy. This is the longest method to do it. In the new version of Instagram, uh, a new version of Snapchat, you will be able to find of the option of delete account somewhere here. But in my, I don't know why it's not here. But in your case, if that happens, then you can just deactivate it from there. I hope you found this video very useful. If you did, like this video, subscribe.